If phase 5 is like Quantumania, God save us from phase 6, 7 and 8. Admin 3 getting awful reviews. Has internet convinced MC is now a sinking ship? So let's talk about it. Followed by disastrous phase 4, fans have had huge expectations from Ant-Man 3, which is set to establish phase 5 and phase 6 of the MCU. Fans have been highly anticipating the return of Ant-Man after he joined the Avengers against Thanos. However, the good old days of the Marvel Cinematic Universe seem to have ended with Avengers Endgame. The follow of films trying to establish the future of MCU have resulted in some of the worst Marvel movies. And looking at the initial review of the film, it seems like the sequel for the 2015 film Ant-Man is also headed on the same path as Ant-Man 3 getting terrible reviews. Ant-Man 3 didn't get off the good start that either the studio or the fans were hoping for. The initial reviews for the film are out and they do not sound very pleasing. It has turned out to be the second lowest rated MCU film getting a 55% critic score on Rotten Tomatoes with 122 reviews. Critics also do not seem to have anything good to say about the film except for its villain. While Paul Rudd is given credit for his performance, critics have praised Michelle and Jonathan Majors for stealing the show. Although Jonathan Majors does his best for what he is provided, Critics did point out that the film is unable to establish his character as the next supervillain of the MCU. They have called the film desperate for its gloom, saying that the film comes up short in almost every other way that matters. Many even compared the quantum realm with films like Star Wars, saying enough ugly landscapes and googly creatures to power two Star Wars pictures and a half a dune. Others also said that Ant-Man 3 seemed confused if it should be a crazy comedy or a gritty drama, due to the huge contrast between the tone and narrative. The ratings and reviews of Ant-Man 3 have led MCU fans to worry if this is what the studio is planning to serve in the upcoming phases. Fans seem worried about the MCU, wondering if they will get to see movies like the early stages of the MCU or whether the upcoming films will continue to suffer in the future phases as well. So we end our video here and uh, let us know about your opinion in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to our channel and I'll see you in the next video.